All right, so here we are at the top. Here's the mansion, really big mansion. Uh, the mansion is actually, you have to pay cash today. Their, their electronic system's not working, so we can't enter. But I'll enter it another day so you can see inside the mansion. So it's very cheap. It's 10 hay eyes to enter. But again, we have to, you have to use cash and we don't have cash today. <laughs> so, but this here is their carriage house that has a bunch of uh, stuff inside that we're gonna take a look into as well. This is free here to enter. And after here, we're gonna head over to that church over there. We're gonna walk over. It's a really nice church. So these carriages are pretty amazing. The guy told me that this carriage here is about 60 to 70% real gold. So, uh, and they have many carriages and each one was uh, made for a specific purpose of their travel. At the end here, I will take a still photo for, so you can see which carriage was used uh, for each type of travel that the, the royal family did. But it's amazing that how intact and preserved these carriages are. You know, the wood is perfectly polished, the leather has some or no tears in it, and uh, the, the, the material inside the carriage as well is really intact. And this train here was was also built in 1800s at the time and they used it to transport cargo over a specific location. And this gentleman here was the curator for the museum and putting all the items together and explaining what all the items were uh, used for. 
uh, from 1960. And in the back there is their uh, cultural center and here is just another carriage house that's administrative that you can't enter. So uh, that's how big this whole mansion complex uh, was for the royal family.